Satnam, Namaste, welcome. My name is Mark Swan and today I'm going to be talking to you about the two tuned planet gongs, the two moon gongs. Over my shoulder here is the synodic moon and this is the sidereal moon. The synodic moon is the full moon gong and the sidereal is the new moon gong. The synodic moon resonates to 105.21 hertz when struck at the center in the musical tone of G sharp. The sidereal moon gong resonates at 113.71 hertz when struck at the center to get the fundamental note. And that's in A2 sharp, so musically they're miles apart. Both gongs are very etheric, gentle and magical gongs. Um, two or three minutes into a moon gong, either of these moon gongs, and you suddenly find yourself magically transported somewhere else. How did I get here? What's going on? I can't quite discern what's happening. And that's basically the premise of the new moon and the full moon. You don't look at the moon and go, that is the reflected light of the sun. You look at the moon and you go, wow, it's a place for poets and artists to muse gently on. Both gongs are connected quite powerfully to the sacral, the soft belly. And if you think of the crab, when you flip it over on its back on that hard shell, you have that soft underbelly, the vulnerable part. And this gong very much works on our vulnerabilities, our psychic abilities, our empath, empathic energy. Also, it balances and enhances sexuality. It's a very sensual, very gentle gong. We become very intuitive and very touchy-feely. They're both good for clearing energy and healing and bringing us into a space where we're more respectful to those softer feelings. We're not in the head, we're not hard. We are soft and receptive, sensual, gentle. We're balanced. So it's a beautiful, beautiful gong. Both work with the astrological sign of Cancer the Crab. Both gongs are about the inner emotions. Both are to do with yin, the feminine, shakti, uh, women play a moon gong much better, in my opinion, than men, because women are tied to the cycles of the moon with their monthly cycle, uh, and they understand the moon's energy much better than men ever will, and that's just genetic and gender. So I'm going to play the synodic moon first. This is a slightly bigger gong than this one. This is a 26, this is a 24, it's a 26, because it's an older pasty gong, and um, a long time ago, they, as a cost-cutting exercise, stopped making 26-inch gongs and made them all 24. And this is a slightly newer one. Uh, it was a cost-cutting exercise and it wasn't very well received by the healing community. But uh, hey-ho, that's the way it goes. So I'm going to play the Synodic Moon first, then I'm going to play the Side of Real Moon. This one is the culmination. It's the full moon, it's the zenith. It's the high point of all that energy brought together over one month. So it's very much a celebration, it's powerful, it's transporting. This one is bright, it talks of new beginnings, it talks about the beginning of something that's gonna grow. It's quite effervescent and bright, exciting. It's a good time to set intentions with the new moon. I personally think that the new moon is more powerful than the full moon. The full moon, all you can do is go, hooray, we're celebrating the full moon, that's it. With the new moon, you can say, okay, we're going to build over the next month. Let's set a very powerful intention. Let's think about what we're going to create and build. And you can go into a ceremony with the new moon gong and do some really powerful work to set affirmations, positive affirmations, and working with the astrology of that month, knowing what you're going to be doing, build and create. So it's a, it's a really powerful little gong. Both good to be played on the full moon and the new moon in ceremony and ritual in gong baths. Um, easy to transport, not too expensive not good to play in the daytime. I'm gonna be playing them now for you, but it's good if you closed your eyes and imagine it was dark and you could see the moon out the window and yeah, it makes it more magical somehow. All right, enjoy. Thank you. 